In the last video, we got to take a look around the truck. Today, we're gonna hear what it sounds like. Hey, uh, what's going on everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to part two of the Plager Outlaw by CNH Modding. Today, we're gonna be taking a look at the different engine sounds of all five different engines. We've got a bunch of stuff to go over today, plus, we're gonna go over a feature that we talked about yesterday that wasn't quite sure about. Well, CNH has answered the call and we know what it is. So you know what? Let's jump right in. So let's jump into the store and let's take a look at some customization. If you want to see customization of the full truck, check out yesterday's video. We will have that link below. Today is going to be all about engine sound. So CNH Monica said ever saying, there are five sets of engine sounds it's to Detroit. The V69, they have their own set. 69 series are different. And then the CAT engines are all the same. The CTA Cummins engine has a unique set, but it's unsure if they're going to be staying or not. So let's take a look at what we have. So we have the uh, Two Choke 6 V69 saying that the V69 have their own set. So I'm assuming that means that the V69s are all exactly the same. Then we have the 69 series saying that they are different. Uh, that would make sense. We have a 12.7 liter and we have a 14 liter. So understandable that those would be a little bit different. Then, of course, we have the Caterpillar engine, the Caterpillar engines that are in here. These are all the same. Those are all going to sound the same. And then we have the Come Apart or the Cummins C14 and the ICX. I imagine those are going to be the same with this, the CTA being completely different. CTA is actually what we showed off yesterday. And funny enough, it sounds like that this is the least impressive out of all of them. So I'm real excited about this. So let's start off with the Two Choke 12V69. Let's lease ourselves one of those. Let's take a listen. Let's jump in and let's turn on Unfold Truck. So now we are going to be able to hear the Jake. Is incredible. Now that was again the two choke 12 V69. Let's go over to the 69 series and he says that the 69 series are different. So 69 12 and the 69 14. So let's start off with 69 12. <laughs> Turn on the Jake brake.
Now that was the 12.7 liter we were just using. Let's go over to the 14 liter. My understanding is this is different. And you know what we're doing next. Let's turn on the jake brake. Now that we have separated both the two toke and we've now taken a look at the 69 series, well, now let's go into the Caterpillar engines. Now he does say that all of these are the same, so we might as well just go with whatever the largest one is. We have the most amount of power. There we go. We'll take this one. This is the S15. Now that the cat engines are done, let's move over to the C14 and the ICX. These bad boys right here, these are some really, really nice engines right here. Let's uh, let's take a look. So let's take a look and see what he has said. So he says the uh, CTA Cummins is different. Um, five unique to Detroit. Okay, so let's see. I think the C14 and the ICX are going to be a little bit different. So. Let's take a look first at the C-14.
Again, that was the C14. Let's go over to the ICX engine next. Let's jump in here and let's take a listen to this one. And lastly, let's take a listen to the engine that we heard yesterday. Now, a lot of you guys have already heard this one. This was the first impression that most of you had with this amazing truck. Let's take a listen. I was told by CNH Mining that the last engine, the CTA, is much quieter than the other ones, and they all have the exact same starting and ending sound, or starting and stopping sound. So I uh, just wasn't able to get those quite together. Still going to be working all that, so don't you worry about that. And then the last piece today was this little guy. You see this? <laughs> you may not see it. It's the axle. That is what this does. It brings it down. There was one control yesterday that I was having a hard time figuring out kind of what it did. And he said that he was unable to make that option disappear when you don't have the third axle installed. So, hey, we know what it is now, so that's okay. And if it's not there, won't do anything. Ta-da! Yo, what do you think about the Plager Outlaw truck now? Let me know which sounds were your favorite and if there's anything else that you want me to expand on, let me know. Again, I want to give a huge shout out and thank you to CNH Mining for trusting me to show you guys this and to bring this to you. Very cool of you, man. That is so awesome. I'm honored. Well, guys, with all that out of the way, that is going to be it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you drop a like on it. Get subscribed to the channel if you do. And join the Go Ham fam. Make sure you turn your notification bells on as well so that you never miss daily farming simulator videos here on the channel. All be said, hope you have a great, awesome, wonderful rest of your day. We'll see you later. Peace.